I don't know what that was. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, if you're new here, welcome. I'm Makora. I'm really weird and I drink way too much coffee and that's okay. Um, I don't, I have no idea what that was. I, just, I feel like I'm in the twilight zone or something today. It's just like a really weird day and I can't believe that this is my life. Um, yeah, I, I just, I, I cannot fathom the events that are taking part in my life. I support them. I love them. And, um, that's all I'm going to say on the matter because it's a personal matter and I just thought I'd sit down and get my makeup on. Um, we got a play date this afternoon. Maybe we'll go to the park before lunch. I don't really know, but I need something on my face. Okay. So I'm going to go in with the Becca shimmering skin perfector liquid. I have like a little, oh, my friend. Squeezy tube. Squeezy tube of it. Little squeezy poop. I'm so weird today. I don't know why. Is this empty? There it goes. That's way too much. Now it's empty. I'm so strange. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you have to put up me. <laughs> Dang, so weird. I wonder how fast I could do my makeup. Should we do a challenge? Let's see how fast I can do my makeup. And still talk. Because I'm weird. I like to talk a lot. I like that. I haven't used that Becca Skin Perfecting in a long time. I wonder how much it, a full size is. Probably like super expensive because it's Becca. Um, I'm going to go in with a little bit of a pore filling. Just the e.l.f. Poreless Putty. I like this one. A lot. A lot, a lot. My friend Marge is texting me. I can see it. I don't know what it says because it says that I have a text message. It doesn't read it to me because I'm a teacher. Um, wow, I've got four text messages now. I'm a popular person this morning, Marge, huh? No. Um, yeah, okay, so there's the primer. I actually don't want to put that in my empties bucket just yet because I'm going to want to link it for this video and I'm not going to remember what I used. So then we are going to go in to... I'm so weird. And you know what? I'm just, I don't want to think about it. I'm just going to use the um, Physicians Formula Healthy Foundation. I haven't used this in a hot minute. Oh my god. That just happened. Um, I'm sitting on a table because this is a, wow, this is a video. Um, I'm sitting on a table because my chair is downstairs. And this just, I didn't even know that could do that. Oh, it's real shake it up now. It's a cool show. It's a cool show. Did you just see that fling of um, foundation across my room? It landed on a coat hanger. It's okay. It's not the rug. Although the rug's disgusting and I need a new one anyways, so it's fine. <laughs> we still have this like original carpet that came with the house when we bought it. It's gross. It's like a uh, hot wax spilled on it and it's just not, it's not cute no more. Oh, that is white, huh? I got a tan going on. It's okay, we'll fix it with bronzer. We'll give us a fake tan on top of our real tan. It's fine. It's fine. We'll cover the real tan, and then we'll fake it with bronzer. Right? That makes sense. Really, I just need to pick up a new foundation shade. In that. Look at how much lighter I am. My arms compared to my face. So what shade is that that I just used? Did I put it away? No, it's right here. It's right in front of my face. Um, 
LC1. So this is the shade LC1, and it's a bit light for me. I kind of want to pick up a second shade of this. Um, but we'll make it work. More pat hair. We're going to make it work. It'll, it'll be fine. Okay. Because I want to use different products than I used last time. I'm going to go in with the Physician's Formula Natural Defense Concealer Total Coverage Plus Sunscreen 30 SPF. I'm almost out of this. Yeah. It's getting a little low. I forgot how much I like that concealer. It blends out so neat nicely. It's like, boop, done. Just like that. Boop, done. I like the boops. Boop, 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 boop. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> it's fine. Morning, guys. Today is a roller coaster. You know who that just reminded me of? The roller coaster. Like, um, Crocodile, that guy. He passed away. He was stung by a, um, in the heart. He was stung in the heart by a stingray. The crocodile hunter? You know who I'm talking about. I don't know his name. Um, this is the Mattifying Bamboo Foundation from Bird's Bees, and I'm using it to set under my eyes. Actually, I, I think I'm just going to use it to set everywhere, because <sighs> I don't want to get a second powder out and be kind of lazy. So how are you guys? I'm being weird over here and like I don't know see like I'm being weird so like how are you I'm weird today apparently it's it's a weird twilight zone -y day I'm gonna use the starlet studio tropical Paris pressed pigment palette um I haven't used it a whole lot on my channel and I just kind of want to, I want to try it out. It's available at Target. Um, I think it's like 15, 12, 15 dollars, something like that. I'm not really sure. I'm going to go in with this, uh, bikini, beige bikini it's called. And there is no mirror in this palette. There's beautiful artwork, um, but there's no mirror. So I'm going to go in and I'm going to use this mirror because it's, I like it. I like this mirror. I don't know why I like hunch down and do that and then you can never see me. If I stay sitting straight upright, then you can see my face. Let me scooch closer. There. It's way better. So there's that. And it is just like a light wash of color, um, that shade. But I didn't really think it was going to be much of a color because if you look at it, it's basically my skin tone. Um, so now I'm going to go in with this Coconuts shade over here. And I'm going to put that um, kind of like in the crease also in like the outer V. For a pressed pigment palette, this is not very pigmented. Um, I was expecting more pigment, not, not gonna lie. It's a very subtle shade, um, but it's showing up, like it's doing it. Okay, and then I'm going to use a hot dish brush. I want to clean it off because I don't want it to be yellow. 
yellow on red would make orange. I don't want an orange eye. I want a red eye. Maybe. Okay. So I'm going to use the sun, sun Sunset Shade, which looks like a bright red, but we're going to find out. Oh, it is kind of bright reddish. It's actually really pink. Like, wow, that's pink. I wasn't expecting that, but okay. That's a lot pinker than I was expecting. But it blended out nicely. Okay, so then I'm gonna go into, um, this is gonna take a turn. I'm gonna go into this bright, like, bluish green called Night Swim. I'm gonna pack that, like, on the lid. Okay, going back into the sunset. Pouring that out. Taking a flat shader brush. With the night swim shade. And I'm just um, intensifying that lip. Actually, you know what? I want to see if um, if I wet the brush, if it's going to make a difference. Okay, there's quite a bit of fallout with that shade, which kind of sucks, because I've already got my face, but I'm just going to brush it away and hope for the best. Okay, again, sunset on that shader brush, and I'm just gen super gently blending it into the crease and like making a super pretty purple. Like that. I'm going to take the color sea glass on my pinky, which is right here. It's this light green, and tap that in the center. Just like that. And then there is this really pretty, um, yeah, like blackish gold right here um called at dusk and i'm gonna smoke that into the outer corner i get my hand so dirty because i do this with all my brushes okay so now i'm gonna go make this eye match and i'll be right back and then i'm gonna take this shade called jellyfish right here it's that really light pink um and i'm gonna pop that on the inner corner that little pinkness right there. I feel very mermaid-like today. Not pretty. 
Um, okay, so now I'm going to use this. Um, it's called Deep Sea by a Hard Candy. I thought it was fitting because, like, we got some ocean eyes going on. I'm going to go do brows and my lashes and I'll, right. so I'm back and my lashes are done and my brows are done. And, um, I just want to say that this, like, this is the Starlet Studio Tro Tropical Paradise Pressed Pigment Palette. I've got some watermelon beautiful eyes going on right here. Can you just look at this? Right? So gorgeous. Okay. So now we're gonna go in and we're gonna use some bronzer and some blush and some highlight. I don't know what that was either, but we're gonna go with it. Okay, so I'm gonna turn on crazy right now. It's fine. It's fine. So this is the Found Baked Bronzing Powder in 50. It looks a bit orange, but I haven't tried it, but we're gonna, ooh, that's real shiny and orange. That's scary. We're gonna go and we're gonna do it. I'm gonna use a stippling brush because I'm super scared. That already looks orange on me. Yep, no, no, nope. So we're gonna go in and we're gonna try that again. Um. Redo, we're gonna try the, we're gonna go in with the Winky Lux Mocha Bronzer. This is like really, if you can see that, really dusty, but it's so nice. And it's just like that Mocha Brown. Fake tan. My hair is all over the place. Oh, and it smells like coffee too, which is like a total plus. Right? Anything that smells like coffee when you're putting it on your face, it's like, ah, heaven. Okay. I just want to take my big bronzing brush from LMR Cosmetics and like buff it out a little bit more. Okay. A little bronze in the chest. Why not, right? Um, so I don't know what I'm going to do with this fabric and bronzer. Maybe I'll try it again um, with a more like orangey bronzy look and maybe that will do it, but it it was, it, I mean, it was orange. It was like orange on my forehead. Okay, so then I want to do a, another one of these. A blush. <laughs> that word that I was looking for. Okay, we're going to use two different palettes that are look exactly the same, and I'm sorry, but I really want to. So this is the Tarte. Pro Glow palette and this is the Tarte Pro Glow palette and they look exactly the same but they're not. So in the first palette it looks like this. We're going to use this blush. We're going to use this um, pinky blush in this palette. And then this is the second Pro Glow palette and um, it looks like this on the inside and we're going to use the highlighters in this palette. We're going to use these two highlighters or these two. I don't know. We're going to use a highlighter in the palette. Or multiple blush brush. I don't think I've ever used this blush before, actually, now that I'm looking at it. Hmm, interesting. It's pink. It's very soft. I like it. Other side. It's like the baby pink, you know, like the, the classic baby pink blush cheeks. That's how I feel. I like that. 
My eye keeps watering. I don't know why. Maybe I have like an eyelash in it or something. Um, so now we're going to go into the other Pro Glow palette like I was saying. And we're going to use the... I'm going to mix these two. The two shades, Stunner and Strobe, I'm going to mix them. We're gonna set it. Oh, I wanna close my palette first. Okay, now I'm gonna use my, my big palette here to. Okay. And now for the leaks. I don't know what that was either. I'm crazy. I went to something fun. I think I want to use this. This is the NARS. Um, I want to use it again, I should say. I've used it once before. And I wasn't a huge fan of it. But I'm willing to give it a second chance. Because maybe I just applied it like too much of it or something. I don't know. But we're going to do it again. Um, it's called Warm Leatherette from NARS. And it looks like this. It's quite pretty. It's like really liquidy though. Like super liquidy. And I'm using this as my lip liner. Cause it's like, it comes to like a super sharp point. I'm just applying a super fine, thin, like layer because this is a very liquidy liquid lip and I look like I'm making a mess out of it. I'm not, I promise. Oh, you can't see that. Crap, I got it on my lip ring. It's gonna make a mess now. I'm just trying to get off my lip ring. Alright, that was really difficult to put on. And I still don't feel like if you look, there's a spot like that I can't. There you go. But I bet you it's gonna bleed around my lip ring. I find that thin formulas like this um, end up like bleeding outside of the lip line when it comes to having a piercing. Which kind of sucks. But there's not much you can really do about it. Other than... Keep some Q-tips in your car. And clean it if you need to. Oh, I want to throw this gloss on top. This is the Virgo from Wet n Wild. Their Sparkle Shimmer Gloss. Like... Right? Uh-huh. I know. I know. I know. So I'm gonna just like tap it. You can never have too much glitter. I'm sorry, you just can't. Mm-hmm. I like this color. I like the, um, I like this gloss here. I'll get close so you can see it. This is a very colorful summertime look, but I am digging it because it's summertime and it's colorful and beautiful and there's nothing not to love about it, right? I feel like a beautiful mermaid. I'm like a- Mama's a sparkly unicorn mermaid today, yes! Um, okay, well that was a lot and you're welcome and thank you for hanging out with me this morning i hope you got to get to get what? what 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 did i just try and say i don't even know i hope you got to um should i just show you the highlight yes 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 oh oh work it oh my
my god. Ah, yes. Ah, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm crazy. Um, anyway, I don't know. I'm, I'm a little, this video is like all over the place. I'm sorry. Um, thank you for hanging out with me guys. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Join our little community that we have going here because I would love to have you. And if you don't want to hang out again, like then that's totally fine. Don't hit the subscribe button and don't hang out with us again. But then we might be a little bit sad. Not going to lie. Because I like hanging out. And this is fun. <laughs> and if you made it this long, I appreciate you. <laughs> um, thanks for hanging out, guys. I'm just going to shut off the camera now because I can't stop rambling. Bye.